We got a very seasonal question this week regarding the discipline of Lent. Uh, a lot of people have been asking me um, if we are allowed to suspend our observance of Lenten discipline on Sunday. And I think the reasoning behind thinking that we might be able to do that is the fact that um, uh, in the account of creation, God rested on the seventh day. So a lot of people sort of perceive Sundays during Lent as a day to rest from Lenten discipline. And to that point, I will offer a few things. First of all, there's no evidence in Scripture that when Christ went out into the desert for 40 days, that he at any point decided he needed some rest and ran back to Capernaum uh, for a day and then back out into the desert again. Secondly, I know in my own personal practice of Lent, um, I honestly am not longing for the things that I gave up for Lent. It's not as though every day I'm thinking about, oh, well, gee, you know, I really wish I had some chocolate, or I really wish I had a beer, or I really wish I could watch some TV. I, I, don't, I don't really think about it in those terms. I think more in terms of what am I doing with the time or the energy or the attention or the passion that I'm freeing up as a result of Lenten discipline, and what fruit is that bringing my life? But at the same time, you know, I'm not sure that I would ever uh, tell anyone who has sincerely discerned that they would like to take a break from Lenten discipline during, uh, during Lent on Sunday. Uh, I'm not sure that I would ever tell someone if they've sincerely discerned that's the right thing for me to do in order to continue to heal and grow and thrive during the season of Lent. If that's true for anyone, I absolutely would encourage them to do that. So all these things being said, um, remember that God is who he says he is. You are who he says you are and live the life that he calls you to live.